every now and then I have to come back to YouTube to cover some things not dealing with somebody either going to jail or getting knocked down. In this particular instance, this is about DW Flame, who is a Long Beach rapper, as well as. And we also have Bosco 100, who is from Queen Street out of Inglewood. Now, these two individuals have been going at it back and forth on social media over comments that Bosco made several months ago about DW Flame being zesty. These ladies, there's some of y'all out there that have been dealing with who been acting this whole time, been putting, putting you acting like people after him. I'm not going to protect you. Like, girl. I, got a little habit. I just got a little habit where if I see nothing moving, there's something in my body that be like, throw something. This ain't looking good. This is a strip club. Either we gonna laugh or we gonna f But this ain't no looking club. Bosco has put out his case on why he feels like DW Flame is zesty. And a lot of times Bosco is telling these jokes on people and a lot of times people either take them or sometimes they get upset well dw flame wasn't having it and he called bosco 100 out for the fade now since calling bosco 100 out for the fade it's been all over social media youtube instagram as well as it hit clubhouse now whack 100 actually was talking about this situation and they had dw flame on stage with them now while on stage with them whack 100 would say that he knew that DW Flame was actually going to knock out Bosco 100. Now, Bosco 100 must didn't like what Wack 100 had to say, so he posted this on his Instagram. Like, blood, I heard you like, oh, you going to oh, nephew. What do you want, blood? Whack, we ain't like, blood. You ain't pulled up. You a scrabble. Like, I scrabble you. Big Messy been wanting to fade. G Principal been wanting to fade. Then you got homies from your own hood wanting to fade. I want to fade you. Now, we know that WAC 100 has been being called out by a lot of different people from a lot of different places. Now, I feel like WAC 100 does do trolling on Clubhouse, and he's not always necessarily serious with the individuals whose skin he's getting up under. Now, there is a couple of people from his neighborhood who claim that they wanted these phase, and they've been on stages with WAC 100 and without WAC 100 talking about this. Now, I'm not for sure about the politics between WAC 100 and his hood, and I'll leave that between them. WAC 100 is a bigger personality than Bosco, so it may not be beneficial for WAC 100 to even get in the ring with Bosco 100. Now, a lot of people bring up the fight now, a lot of people bring up the fade between Bosco 100 and Rose Moe that we all remember also well. Now, it was a video that went viral of Bosco and Rose Moe actually getting into it after Bosco 100 and other and other people ended up getting into it on social media. Now, the, act, the outcome of that particular fade was not in Bosco 100's favor. And a lot of people who go at Bosco 100 continuously bring up that same incident now since then bosco 100 has got into a celebrity fade with the late gonzo in which both individuals ended up creating peace between each other and bosco talked about this a lot but as far as him getting a ring with dw flame or whack 100 we'll have to see what happens with that but get in the comment section it's a lot going on even c mac wants to get in the ring with blueface not sure how all of this is going to work out but get in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think about this. I'm Almighty the Ruler. Make sure you hit that like, share, and subscribe, and click that notification bell so you get notified each and every time I upload new content.